What's up, y'all? So, okay, I want to, TJ, check this out. I think it's very disrespectful that um, that Jag feels so comfortable still going around to this day. Talking about my husband. Can you believe that she's, these motherfuckers wanted to be with my husband? And my husband did this? And you would trust my husband? Yeah, she just so comfortable with saying her husband. Call that nigga by his name. Remember, y'all leaving the past behind y'all. Hmm. But TJ, yeah, TJ want to, yeah, I want to leave my past behind me and what was, was, and that's going to be left there. And yeah, that's my past. And Naisha is my past, this, that, and the other. Yeah. Huh. That's my ex. She referred to Naisha as Naisha. Remember, they was talking about they was married. That was her wife. She hurried up and switched that. It ain't her wife no more. Hmm. No common law, nothing. So Naisha needs to, I mean, TJ needs to be referring to Naisha as Naisha and her ex. And in the past, I'm leaving the past in the past. And I'm moving on. And I'm with my new girl. And I'm with my bae. But Jag get to be comfortable walking around talking about my husband still to today. She did a video watching other old videos and shit of other girls on the panel. The dirty, uh, not dirty, Nick Nikki, and then the other girl. Uh, what's the other one name who did the little video um, recording him and shit? Whatever her name is. The one who don't take care of her damn kid. Her son. I feel so bad for her damn son to this day. I still feel so bad for him. For the for the for the uh the uh the phone sex girl that Goomba you know got recorded and got caught up with or whatever her son and they would they would trust my husband well why you won't refer to him as Goomba hmm you you a little bit too comfortable calling him your husband and you done moved on supposedly and you leaving the past in the past it's a two-way street right we got the yeah huh or it's just just you just throwing this shit in tj ear yeah you just want tj to do all of that refer to him as goomba now just because you haven't went to go and get some divorce papers and final and go and file for it because remember in another video you sitting up here doing all this yeah uh-huh love bombing and shit uh-huh and yeah i think that it's time for me to go and get a divorce um immediately and you know baby um you know um i just love you and i'm in love with you and this is you know, you the first person that this, and we need that. What's wrong, huh? What's wrong, TJ? What's wrong? Y'all remember the video I uploaded? You said you was gonna, supposed to be going to go get a divorce, huh? Why are you still so comfortable with, with, with calling Goomba your husband? You should be comfortable. First thing that roll out of your mouth should be yeah, Goomba. My soon to be ex husband, yeah. Let that be known. When somebody, when they done, they done. They... Now I'm not saying that she got, you know what I'm saying. She want to go, you know, and she got some ulterior motives, and she really want to go back with Goomba. I don't think that's the case because Goomba done moved on. Yeah, Goomba ain't worried about her. He ain't on hearing nobody comments. He ain't trying to get a fake page to be in no comments. Uh, I I ain't even checked to see if he been on his little page that he had did uh, doing his little video games, showing that he unbothered. Nothing. Nigga just done disappeared from the face of the earth. He ain't got nothing to do with her. But yes, she's still on here watching videos about him catching up and shit. And she watching this shit with Naish. I mean, with TJ. And TJ's stupid ass is sitting there watching it with her. So this is what y'all life have become. Hmm. I don't see you guys doing nothing else other than this. Her monitoring some fucking YouTube and shit. Are you serious? Like, are you serious? And you think that we supposed to take y'all relationship serious? Huh? Oh, now she's, she's, now, uh, now, uh, I was watching King Payne, another little audio. Jack's in there saying all type of shit too. Oh, so now she need to, yeah, she in there crying, Jag going off. She in there crying. Don't nobody want to hear all that crying. She need to toughen up. She a public figure now. Bitch, you ain't no public figure like that. You need to pump your motherfucking brakes, bitch. The fuck? Huh? You you this big public figure in your motherfucking eyes. No, we on this bitch clowning your ass. Yeah, we getting on this motherfucker roasting your ass. Yeah. 
and reading your motherfucking ass from A to Z. Yeah, like you need to be. Ain't nobody on here glorifying you. Yeah, no. And we ain't doing that shit like we do with other celebrities or that. You know, we giving them their little credit, Nicki Minaj. We ain't on here. Nah. Okay. All right. Ain't nobody even on here as a public figure um, getting in celebrity asses like that all the time unless something really come up where they have to. But other than that, no, nah, we staying on your ass and we getting off in your ass like it need to be. Yeah, that's totally different. And you call that being a public figure? Are you serious? Because YouTubers is digging off in your ass? Are you serious? And you trying to manipulate uh, well, let her ass get manipulated and get used and abused. Yeah, I hope you use her ass for everything that the fuck she got and dog her ass out, TJ ass. She need it. Yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah. And I and I just like how Goomba was quiet and shit like that. I'm starting to get to a point where I'm like, now you should come on now. Enough is a fuck enough. Yeah. Enough is enough. Okay, Jag always want to be the one coming out here. Now, I'm not sure if it's true, you know, um, as far as the allegations that's coming out here about their kids and what's going on, all this shit. I'm not sure. But it just seems to just be a coincidence that somehow that every time Jag in the picture, Jag always want to say that somebody she just always is mixed in with somebody that done did something. Yeah, the essay or something. Yeah. Huh? Why is that? Why the fuck is that? Goomba mama done did this to him when she done broke up with him. Yeah, anytime she get into it with somebody, it seemed like she always want to cough up these allegations and shit. Now, again, I don't know if the shit true or not. And why would TJ be sitting there pillow talking? You ain't got shit else to talk about other than that? Huh? Y'all got these big ass plans. What is y'all supposed to be going to go look for houses and shit? Huh? You just pillow talking, talking about this shit. And Jag taking all this shit. How would Jag know all this shit? Uh, unless you didn't tell you had to done tell her this shit. What is you telling her this shit for? Huh? Why? What is the point? To just sit there and pillow talk because you ain't got shit else to talk about? Hmm. That's what it seemed like to me. You ain't known this motherfucker six months and you sitting there pillow talking, telling her all this shit. All this business. She ain't even met your mom. Oh, her mom passed. I think TJ mom passed. You, she ain't met your cousins, TJ. You ain't want to go take her, drive, take a trip. Can't Jack leave? She not on uh, house arrest, right? Can't Jack? Oh, Jack can't leave from um, Texas or something? Oh, Jack can't leave from Texas. And they think that this cute that TJ got to ask her sister for money? I thought TJ was the breadwinner. And Jag okay with that. That's okay with Jag. Yeah, Jag, shut up. I'm about to go outside. And, and you, how old is um uh, uh TJ again? You got to go outside and ask your sister for some money. And Jag coming in the background yelling and screaming. And you done just tried to tell your sister, uh, you know, yeah, I'm in love. I done met them. And you trying to explain this to your fucking sister that you in love with somebody you just done met. And they can go online and see who this bitch is. Huh? And you think they finna just um, accept her with open arms and shit and just accept her into the fucking family? Are you serious? The same way you claim they didn't like Naisha is the same way they definitely not not about to like Jag ass. Jag ain't that type of person to get along with people, family and shit because she don't get along with her own motherfucking family. Okay? All right? She don't get along with her own at all. Seem like she like to be just uh yeah she she wanna um uh just like she like to have other people and just keep them to herself she she uh what do you call I can't even got motherfucker I can't even think y'all I'm telling you every time I start talking about this motherfucker like it seem like I get speech impaired and shit like what the fuck. You don't want to be around your family. You don't want her to be around her family. TJ got to go outside, hide, and sneak and shit and walk away to talk to her family. Because you in the background and shit. What? And you think that that's normal, TJ? Huh? You think that that's normal? They just supposed to accept her. They looking at you like, damn, what type of motherfuckers? And you sitting here talking about Naisha, um... Uh, Really not, you know what I'm saying, uh, gay? 
Jack not either. Have you saw some of her interviews? She done said it. That she wouldn't marry or be serious in a relationship with uh, with another woman like that. It would be a man. And she explained why I just can't find that clip. And she even went into detail of why she wouldn't. Who went into details? She said she would just be more serious or married when it comes to marrying or being in a relationship. That she would be with a man. That kind of like being with women is kind of just fun, is what she said. Hmm. But you want to talk about um, Naisha not being, you just seem like you attract motherfuckers who just pretend to be playing the role of being that, huh? Are you really who the fuck you are? Huh? Why are you attracting? They say you attract your own kind and shit. Huh? Are you really who you are? Shit. Or did something happen to your ass and you just turned, huh? Yeah, when you was younger or something. While you sitting there talking about uh, Naisha and what she done went through and all this shit. And Jack want to sit there and put Naisha uh, info out there and shit. Jack, you should have been in the mother. The way you explained how you grew up, trying to make it seem like you was just so horrifying to live how you was and growing up how you was growing up. Huh? Your mama made you, uh, uh, did she say she made her eat it or the sister eat it from the garbage disposal or some shit? Yeah, you should have been in the damn foster care, huh? You should have been in the foster system from how you telling everybody how you was raised, huh? Everybody in your family got schizophrenic but your ass. Yeah, you the only normal one in your fucking family and shit. Leave it up to you, hmm? Leave it up to her ass. She the only normal-minded motherfucker in the family. Everybody else got issues. Are you serious? And TJ is sitting here allowing this shit? And listening to this shit. That's why when I was like listening to TJ really telling Jag off when I was hearing the argument on the other audio that King Payne had, had leaked or, or put out. I'm like, she telling her shit that we, we get on here and say about her ass. That's how she really feel. Her shit, that don't go away just because you happy. Just because everything is cool and just simmer down and y'all not arguing no more. No, you still deep down in your heart feel that way about that motherfucker. Okay, you saying all that shit. Oh, you just felt that way. You just, huh? You just spazzed out, huh? You just, no, you wasn't there. You wasn't clowning her. You wasn't roasting her. You was giving her a piece of your motherfucking mind when when we heard TJ uh, on the recording talking about, you know, Jag and how she feel about Jag. That's how you really motherfucking feel. So what's really going on? I'm sitting here listening to this shit like, yeah, but but Jag need to stop referring to Goomba as her husband. Yeah, you just let her go around saying this shit. Then when you try to explain to Jag why the fuck she need to stop saying that, and that's just really, you need to refer to him as Goomba when you, yeah. If I'm moving on and I'm doing these different things and showing you that I'm leaving my past in my past and I'm moving on because we together, then you need to show the same motherfucking thing. And you need to explain to her the reason why you crying is because your ass is don't want to take off on her motherfucking ass is what you need to explain. Because she talking from the audio that I just heard from King Payne right now. She talking about TJ like TJ some little punk or some shit. Yeah, some people just cry because they, yeah, they need to cry that shit out because they they're ready to put their hands on your ass. They afraid of what the fuck they going to do. They'll get mad, that mad to where they'll just start crying because they want to do something else to your ass. Trust me. They ain't just crying because they, you know what I'm saying, because they some punk, punk punk-ass bitch or something. No. That's the only way to let it out. Because if I don't let it out this way, I'm going to let it out another motherfucking way. Hmm. Will your ass get that mad? You just have to fucking cry. But TJ just going around letting her talk to her like this and shit. I'm saying like, well, wait a minute. With TJ, I'm thinking to myself, well, was TJ right there listening to this while Jag was saying this? Yeah, because Jag was sitting there kind of like she had some balls or something. Bitch, you need to calm the fuck down. Straight up. Talking about uh, telling TJ, yeah, she need to get on. And if she ain't with this or that or whatever, then she need to get on. Bitch, I'm about to get on. You don't need Jag. Jag need you. Did you forget? Fuck. 
Y'all, that shit got me pissed off. Like, who the fuck does Jack think she is? This bitch need to be put in her place, straight up. The fuck? And TJ just sitting there stupid ass around, just letting this shit ride like this. Yeah, you know, um, that's my baby. This and yeah, you can, babe. Yeah, everything all right. Bitch, you need your ass whooped too. The fuck? Fuck is wrong with you know what, y'all? This shit getting out of hand. I'm serious. And I'm like, Naisha, like, come on, Naisha. Damn, if you got to go have you a drink or something, shit. Sitting there letting the motherfuckers just jump you, man. Oh, my fucking God, y'all. This shit, you know what? Mm, mm, mm. I am not even about to let this shit piss me off. This shit about to piss me the fuck off. Straight up. Bitch, you got Jack, you got... Mm. Mm, mm mm-mm. Are you serious? Mm.